Hi everyone, I'm Pei Xixiong from Northwestern University. Today I will present our work, TA Student VQA, Multi-Agents Training by Self-Questioning. There are two main challenges in visual question answering. The first one is that the selling effect for specific questions is difficult to overcome with simple consecutive training. And the second challenge is that even the state-of-the-art dataset is of large scale. Questions targeted at a single image are off in format and lack diversity in content. Thus, our tasks become two. First, how to train multi-VQA models efficiently. And second, given an image, how to generate questions with diversity. Let's first regard the training aspect of visual question answering as exam preparation, and the testing part as the final exam. Previous work used the annotated data to train one model and update the parameters using the result. This scenario is similar to when a student prepares for an exam alone. The student can only improve himself by taking the exam. However, empirically, the exam questions are limited, which leads to a difficulty in reinforcing learning and lack of generalization. In our work, we involve an agent that plays a similar role as teaching assistant, TA, therein generating questions based on the given image. In addition, we introduced the idea of using two question answering agents to realize collaborative learning, similar to two students preparing for their exams without a solution menu. They can only make progress by discussing the topic with each other. We now formally introduce our approach. The testing phase of the VQA task can be formatted as finding the correct answers in the space of candidate answers. However, for the training phase, unlike previous method of VQA, we alter the strategy by involving a self-QA stage. A TA model is responsible for writing questions for the given image, and two VQA models are set to output corresponding answers. Once the answers converge, the supervision stage is performed. There is an oracle that asks questions from the dataset to update the two VQA models and TA model. Let's go with it one by one. The question generating agent acts as a TA, which is designed to generate a set of questions and also need to be related with the given image. To obtain these properties, three submodels are built and combined. The first one is the question generation model, which is responsible for proposing questions based on the given image. The second one is the question validation model, which checks if the generated questions are grammarly correct and relevant to the content. And the third one is the informative selection model, which selects the most informative questions from the question proposals to improve the training efficiency. For the question answering agents, two VQA agents access two students to answer the questions generated by the TA. Once their answers softly converge, which implies that after several rounds of discussion, these two students finally come to an agreement. Then it is time for the real exam. The Oracle Check model is responsible for supervising and updating parameters of the question generation model and the VQA agents. This will prevent the two agents from converging to a local optimum. Once the last change is slower, it will go back to the QA stage. Here are some qualitative results. The results indicate how our model is capable of answering questions that require multiple tasks, such as counting, finding objects, and performing reasoning. We evaluate our model in the aspect of question complexity. With different iterations, the format of the generated questions varies, from is there, to what, to how. Additionally, the complexity and diversity increase, from simply asking object attributes, to counting, and then doing reasoning. For our overall performance comparison, we compare the performance with two sets of VQA agents. And here are the results. This indicates that either combination will improve the result. Furthermore, the more structure differs, the greater the improvement. We also evaluate the model performance over the questions in the annotated dataset and over the generated questions. They show that such a self-QA mechanisms not only perform better in the annotated dataset, but also performed well for the questions that are of the distribution of the training data, thereby improving the generalization ability. Right up. Our paper introduces a self-QA pattern and proposed a system based on this idea. Unlike previous work, our mechanisms overcome the barrier whereby the training QA pairs for each image are limited. Additionally, utilizing two VQA agents combines the advantages of two methods and increases the system capacity.
Thanks for listening.